Well, Vol fans, Bruce Pearl brought his Auburn Tigers up to Knoxville tonight. Uh, went down uh, nine points early in the second half. Shot back, took an eight-point lead. Looked like they had the game in hand. But Dalton Connect said, not in my house. He single-handedly put this UT team on his back. And <clears throat> he hit dagger after dagger after dagger into the hearts of the Auburn Tigers. And uh, sent Bruce, a sweaty Bruce Pearl, back to Alabama. Um, it's, it's hard to overstate what this performance by Dalton uh, was tonight. Uh, quite honestly, it's probably one of the most remembered uh, performances by UT Vol uh, of all time. This was a Herculean effort on his part. Uh, in the light, over about a 10 minute span, in the, an incredible 25 points. Uh, nothing Auburn could do to slow him down. Double team him, didn't matter. They started triple teaming him. He just dumped it off somebody else. Uh, hitting threes, driving to the hole, layups, dunks. Uh, he was uh, not going to lose in Thompson Bowling tonight. This is a monster game in part of a gauntlet of a four game uh, that's just gigantic for the balls. One down, three to go this weekend. It go, we go to Tuscaloosa, and um, this is going to be a a hard, hard one to win. We we blow them out by around twenty points up in Knoxville, embarrass them. We got a gigantic target on our back, but this group of guys, uh, you know, Jonas Adu, Toby Awaka, Ziegler, uh, the veterans in Vescovy and James. Um, some young guys off the bench. Th this is the team that Rick Barnes has been waiting to have here in Knoxville. Um, you know, we, we all are disappointed sometimes with Rick's postseason, but this is a, a a team that could be vying for a number one seed in the NCAA tournament, something we've never sniffed before. Uh, this is a team that could make it to Arizona. It has Final Four potential. And um, this would be a great, uh, maybe Rick's best opportunity ever, really, to bring home a, a national championship. You know, I don't want to get ahead of myself, but when you have an, a guy like Connect who's, you know, 22, 23 years old, he's basically an NBA player out there playing college ball right now. Um, if uh, he was NBA tonight, you know, he'd be getting 20 minutes a game, 15 points a game for you any night. And uh, this is the, the guy, the missing link that uh, he hasn't had since a Durant probably. Um, now, this coming in this weekend, now we're down to three games. We have a one-game lead on South Carolina. Of course, we're tied with Alabama, who we play this weekend. And uh, Auburn and Kentucky and Florida's two games back. Uh, yeah, victory at, in Tuscaloosa can't be overstated. It's going to be a, a incredibly difficult proposition, obviously. But um, if we can pull it off, we're almost guaranteed a co-championship at, in the, at least. Really position ourselves well to try to grab that number one seed. Guys, uh, we appreciate you taking a few moments out of your day to watch the, watch us, listen to us, talk a little UT sports, uh, which I always love. And uh, if you don't care, give us a, a like and subscribe. doesn't cost you anything other than a little click of your finger. Uh, so till Saturday, when we beat the hell out of Alabama, uh, go Vols.